In a perfect world, um, a big fat rib steak, fatty rib steak on the bone, seasoned just with the sea salt and pepper, black pepper, either grilled at a decent temperature um, over uh, charcoal or pan seared in a mix of uh, not much butter and olive oil and basted with butter throughout, finished in the oven just a little bit, pulled out of the oven just short of its desired temperature and allowed to rest. Super important for number one mistake everybody makes is they, they, they take the, the steak off the fire, a perfectly good steak, and whack right into it, and, right. and by doing that, ruin the entire thing. If you just let it sit there for 10 minutes, magical stuff is going on there, important things. Uh, if people just let that happen, it's really impossible, in my view, to improve on that. That is the way God intended us to cook steak. My opinion has changed over the years because I was trained to be a chef and like they're taught all these ways. You gotta like rest your meat, do all this stuff to it, sear it, butter baste it, whatever. I really just enjoy Korean barbecue. I like thinly cut short ribs. Like, I mean, like a really tough piece of meat that you should probably braise, cut thinly and grilled quickly and just eaten with like pickles and condiments. Like, to me, that's a steak at this point. Um, but yeah, I would eat that over going to like eat like a big massive. Because also like when you eat Korean barbecue, it's it's oftentimes eat with lots of vegetables and things like that. And then it's also like um, very interactive and communal kind of uh, dining. I love that. That's my uh, go-to utility meal.